Hi, I'm Mal. Welcome to the video. Today's is Freya's Cauldron Subbox. The Spellkeeper's Chest. Let's open it up. See what's inside. So this is how it arrives. We have our information. That tells us what's in the box. We have an envelope and on the back it says Book of Shadows Pages. I'm going to open this up if I can, without ripping the sticker. And we have information on spell casting, a guide to write your own spells using herbs for spellcraft, cleansing, consecrating and charging your tools. And then we have information on the stone and imolk. So that's new for, for this year. Our first envelope, brown envelope, is an imolk spout for well-being see what's in this one. This is exciting. All new and different. I can get into it. In here we have our spell and what to do. A white candle and three wooden discs that are plain. Let's have a look. And it says you'll also need some pinches of salt and a small cup or bowl of spring water. So that is our spout for well-being. And we have St Bridget's Setting Intentions Pouch. Let's have a quick look in this one. Oh, there's more in there. So we have what we need to do. Two pieces of green felt. A piece of ribbon. Oh, and he, St. Bridget's Cross. Wow. That is beautiful. There you are. And a herb blend. Obviously, the piece of paper tells you exactly what you need to do. Then we have a purple stripy bag. If I can get into it, I don't want to rip the stick out. And inside is... Oh, I've done it. Wow. Spell notes. So there you go. Quick look at the picture. And you've got... little notebook to write how your spells are going, what you need, any ideas for spells or of course you could just use it for your shopping list if you didn't want to use it for anything else. We're continuing on with our pewter pendants and this of course is Imolk. So these are plain on the back and we have three candles for this one. Comes on a long cord. Put that down. Oh, we have a stone. A stone. And this, if I remember rightly, yes, it is, is a dragon stone. Oh, you're not going to be able to see it, are you? Because it's so sunny today behind me. There's our dragon stone. Let's 
see a little, oh, it's candles. It's been, seems that long since I've done one of these. I forgot what's in the box. So we have five candles and they are black, lilac, green, blue, yellow, yellow, orange. Goodness me. Oh, nothing changes, does it? Manifestation Herb Blend. In this jar. I won't open it because you can see. It's jam-packed full of herbs. Dive into the box. We have... And this is how it's come. So it is a little cauldron tea light candle and oil burner. That is so cute. There we have it. I don't want to drop it, so I'm going to pop it down quickly. Move the uh, tube. Manifestation dressing oil. Oh. That was done up well. Oh, that smells um, minty, winter green. So that's our oil used for dressing your candles. You can put it in your oil burner. This must be an altar tile and it is so this is imolk altar tile and little snowdrops there and does it say candle mass yes it does at the bottom so that obviously we can color these in check dig around in the box and our last item this month is truly stunning. It is a spell plate. So there you have the design. It is a tree of life and I've got it upside down. That looks better. So that is our spell plate. To use it, I'll oh, just grab this one. You can put a candle in the middle in a suitable holder. Put your herbs, crystals, around the outside of the candle holder or on the plate. You know, if you watch my walkthroughs, that's exactly what I do. It keeps it all contained in one place and easy to get up once you've finished. So we, so that is this month's box, truly stunning. So we have the spell plate, the magical herbs, the manifestation herbs, the manifestation oil blend, the cutest little cauldron oil burner, the Imolk altar tile, the dragon stone, your five candles, your Imolk pendant, the spell notes pad, St. Bridget's Setting Intentions Pouch. Imolk Spell for Wellbeing. And our brand new Book of Shadow Pages. So there's the Imolk. The Dragonstone information and then everything else that I'd said. So that is January's box. I hope you enjoy the new look of it and everything that's in it. I will see you next month with February's. Bye!